I don't know if you guys have been to Hobby Lobby and seen all of the fall decor that they have out, but if not, I'm going to show you guys what I picked up. With that being said, if that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. Hey friends, so of course this is impromptu. As always, I am just gonna grab at random. There's no rhyme or reason to what I picked up or you know, the items that I have, but I'm gonna try really hard not to edit this video because I have tons of stuff going on. It's summertime, my kids are home. It's Crazy Town USA here, but you guys, Hobby Lobby is freaking amazing. Now, I did not get anything like huge as far as fall items. I did pick up some larger items for my kids' playroom, and I will show you those. I already hung them up, so I will show you guys that um, at the end. But as far as the fall stuff that I picked up, I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. I also stopped by Dollar Tree in a different area and I picked up a few extra things that I did not show in my last haul and that my stores did not have out at the time. So with that being said, let's jump in. Um, first item that I picked up are these little, um, pretty much like vase filler pumpkins. Now, not only do did I want these four vase fillers, however, um, they're super cute for like little embellishments on fall decor. Um, they were $9.99 with 40% off, so around six bucks. I thought that that was a really good deal. Plus, I believe, yeah, they smell really good. They smell like cinnamon. So I picked up one bag of those. And then I also picked up these craft bows. Now, keep in mind, all of the fall stuff is 40% off, like I said. Um, so these were $2.99, 40% off, around $1.50, $1.40, something like that. I don't know, or $1.60, I don't know the exact math. However, I like these because Number one, raffia is super hard to work with, but number two, when you're doing a project and you're kind of in a pinch, um, just grab one of these, stick a little embellishment on it. It's perfect. Plus I love the little buttons in the middle. So I picked up one pack of those. I also picked up these fall bamboo spoon sets. I actually picked up two packs of these. Um, I thought these would be perfect for DIYs, cute and little tiered trays. And these were $3.99 per pack, obviously 40% off. I'm not gonna keep saying that. Y'all just know that they're 40% off. So two packs of those, aren't they so cute? Y'all know if you have been around to know me is to love me and I love anything miniature. I'm just such a sucker for anything miniature. So when I saw these, of course, I had to have them. I'm going to try to stick with like all Hobby Lobby stuff and then I'll do the few dollar tree stuff at the end. Okay, so I have tons of pumpkins, but I just thought these were so cute. Different shapes and sizes and colors. They look super realistic. Um, and this pack was $8.99. So I picked up one of these packs and it comes with three of the white, two of the orange, two of the green pumpkins. So again, I have a huge tiered tray. Maybe I'll include it in this video, like me decorating the tiered tray with this stuff, because the stuff that I got is geared towards a tiered tray. Um, plus, I thought that they were really good prices with the 40% off. Um, I'm a bargain shopper and I'm also one of the people who, if I look at it and I think the price is worth it rather than making it, then I will pick it up. So the next one I got is just plain orange pumpkins. Again, these were seven, or no, not again. I thought they were same price as those, but these were $7.99 um, and they are two different sizes, but just all orange. So I picked up one pack of those. Not that I need any more pumpkins, you guys. Like, oh my God, it's insane, but I want it all. <laughs> okay, so these were $5.49 again. So these have like little gourds in them. That's why I picked these up. I thought they were super cute with the little pine cones and the gourds and the white pumpkins. 
again you never know what you're gonna need this kind of stuff for so i just like to have it just in case so i did pick up one pack of those and they did have different colors as well these were just the ones that i personally picked up oh i love this one okay this little sign isn't that so beautiful? It is real wood on the frame. And this was, oh no, actually that's MDF board. I lied, I'm sorry. But it was only $3.49, so what, a dollar and some change or whatever it is. Um, I didn't think that was too bad. So I did go ahead and pick that one of these up. Okay, the next item I picked up, I love this one. This was $8.99. And if you can see, the little truck has all these little interchangeable pieces. Now, if I'm being quite honest, I don't like football and I'm not a big fan of gnomes. I know that's controversial, but that's just me. Let me know down in the comments. Do y'all like gnomes or are you like me and you're just like, uh, um, but I got it for the truck <laughs> and the hay there pumpkin. Um, and I figured I could find somebody to give these to, um, or paint over them, do something different. But I thought that that was so cute. So the gnomes say, hello, autumn. And then this says it's a, it's a fall play ball. <laughs> And I just loved that like wood embellishment on the truck and the color of the truck. I just thought that was so good. And I thought it was a really good price for all that. So one pack of those. Along the lines of trucks, this was $5.49 as well. Again, with the wood around the hubcaps and it says thankful. And then this, I thought I could put like a few maybe tiny pumpkins back there. I'm not too sure, but perfect for tiered trays, perfect size and perfect price in my opinion. So I did pick up one fall truck. Oh, my girl's friend is here. Okay, the next one I picked up, this was $2.99 pumpkin patch, hay rides, and apple cider, open daily. It's got the buffalo check around. It's a really chunky piece. So I thought that was super affordable. And of course the truck, you know, it's a theme. Um, I can't wait to put together my tear tray. That's why I kind of wanted to get this to you guys because not only did I make a bunch of fall decor for a tear tray with my glow forge, um, that video is out already. Or if it's not out, then it's coming out. But, um, yeah, stay tuned for that. I thought that these went really well with my other decor. <gasps> so, um, like I said, I kind of geared this haul around my tiered tray. Like I said, it's super large. I will leave the Amazon link to my tiered tray um, down in the description box below for you guys in case you're in need of a really, really, really good quality large tiered tray. I got you. So one of those. Sorry, y'all. Trying to grab as much as I can. Okay. The next item I got. Now, this was on clearance, but I just thought it was so stinking cute. It was only $2.99. Now, it is like a card holder, but I won't use it for that. I will just maybe, I don't know but I thought it would be like a little mini tear tray on a tear tray. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy, but I just thought it was so cute. Y'all know I love mini, I love anything mini. So um, they did have a black color too, I believe, but I only picked up a white one. And that's so cute. So if you're having like Thanksgiving dinner or you know, whatever the case may be, a dinner party and you want like a cute little name, name card holder thing, that would be perfect, but me personally didn't get it for that. So picked up one of those. The next one I picked up, this one was $6.49. Isn't that 
so pretty with the little sweater. They did have different patterns and different colors, but this was the one that I personally liked. I thought it was so cute with the raffia bow and the little stem. Again, it's a nice chunky piece, really good price for that. Um, so I picked up one of those. And then the next one I picked up is this little jar. Oh, $5.49 again. Cute little bow with the galvanized piece at the top. Sorry, my, my watch. Uh, pumpkin spice. I just thought they did that really, really well. I loved it so much. Again, they had different colors and patterns, but this was the one that I personally liked. And as always, let me know down in the comments which is your favorite item or are all of them your favorite? Let me know. I'm always curious to hear what you guys think. Uh, I tried to turn my watch off and instead I dinged my phone. Whoops. Okay. The next one I picked up was $2.99. And then it's this little cutting board. It says autumn leaves and pumpkins please and then the autumn and the pumpkin is a 3d effect with the little beads at the top so i thought that was so cute especially for tear trays again they had different patterns and colors and stuff um and then I also picked up one of these, kind of along the same lines as the one with the truck, but this one is orange buffalo check, says farm fresh, got the pumpkins. Farm fresh pumpkins, pick your own. So stinking cute. Now you would spend a lot more like making this, so that's kind of like my logic not only is it super easy just to grab but it was only like a dollar or two so to me i felt that that was worth it because like i said these are pretty pretty heavy pieces i mean um my opinion it's worth it somebody else might not think so but anyway picked up one of these and then these were in the section um where they have like all the Thanksgiving, um, like the dinner table set up or whatever. I can't think right this second. My brain is like, <laughs> I got a lot going on, you guys. This summer has been insane. I didn't realize like what a busy age all of my kids are in right now. And it's just been really busy over here. So my brain is not functioning correctly, but y'all get what I'm saying. Um, and I just thought that that was so cute for DIYs. I could um, like put a transfer on there myself or, you know, maybe something from Dollar Tree, not sure. But I did pick up this one. I picked up several different cutting boards. So I picked up that one. Again, I don't know if I said it was $2.99. I also picked up this set. These are so chunky, you guys, like super heavy. Really, really nice quality. And they were only $9.99, so six bucks for those. That is a steal. So I picked up one pair of those. And then the last one I picked up, again, $2.99, just a different shape than the circle one. Um, I thought that was super cute as well. So there's those. Okay, so the next items from Hobby Lobby I got, they have an entire like fall craft section so not only does hobby lobby have a ton of stuff that's already done up already ready to go but they also have a section for like diy stuff so this was in that section like with the bows and stuff so these were 3.99 and i just love them they're different the color is so vibrant they did really well with the real stick inside i love it i love it 
So I picked up one pack of those. And then these are so cute. Little fall ladders um, for $6.99. It says hello fall with the little buffalo check. Then if you flip it over, look how cute that one is. Now I don't really like apple decor it's just not my style but i know a lot of people do um but i figured that i could like paint that one to fit what i personally like pop that bow off add a different bow paint that add a different wording and boom you have a different ladder so <gasps> love those i only picked up one pack of those Okay, so the last few items that I picked up from Hobby Lobby have nothing to do with fall decor, but I do have a DIY in mind. I saw something at Hobby Lobby when I was there that I knew that I can make for much cheap, much cheaper. So if I see something that I really like, but the price is like, ah, eh, I can make that much cheaper, then I will go the DIY, DIY route. So I did pick up one of these wooden circles. Um, it was $2.49. It's really good size. So there's that one. And I do believe that all of the wood pile stuff was 40% off, but don't quote me. I can't remember. Um, but I did just get uh, several different sizes. So this one is the next size down. For two of them, $3.49 hear my son out there jumping in his little jumper thing and then I got the even smaller ones these were $3.99 as well and you get four in a pack so even even if they weren't any amount off I still felt that that was a really good price so picked up those now that is it for the Hobby Lobby stuff so let's get into the Dollar Tree stuff. Now it's just a few items and um, I'm really excited about them. Okay, so the first one, oh, I guess the bow fell off. <laughs> My girl, uh, Jenny Lee hauled these already. So go check her channel out. Um, but it's a little acorn with the leather piece in the middle says thankful love that y'all dollar tree impresses me more and more like I, I know that i keep saying that if you've been around but i'm so freaking serious like they just shock me every time a new season comes and like the items they're coming out with. I'm just so impressed. Like, look at that leaf with the leather piece. It says grateful. <gasps> so cute for tear trays. So stinking cute. So I did pick up one of those. I also picked up the little, the little, the little, um, what do you want to call these? Rolling pin signs. Falling leaves, that's where the bow came off of. I'll have to glue that back on. Um, but they have the falling leaves with the orange handles. Then they also have the give thanks. I love all three of the colors together, the white, the orange, and the green. And then they also had Hello Pumpkin in orange with the natural wood handles. I love those so much. So I did only pick up one of each of those. Then they also have little signs like this. Now, that's not my favorite design, but I did pick up this one to do something with on the back. I mean, it's okay. It's not horrible. I love how they did the little bow at the top. Happy pumpkin spice season. I love pumpkin spice season, by the way. Okay. And then look at the 
this one. Oh my God, it's so cute. Pumpkin punch with the little 3D pumpkin and the beads on the bow. <gasps> Dollar Tree, you're really doing it up, aren't ya? Aren't ya? <laughs> I know I'm a mess. Y'all don't gotta tell me, okay? I know. I'm losing it. Plus, it's a full moon. It was a full moon last night, so everybody is even more crazy than ever. <laughs> Are y'all affected by the full moon? Let me know down in the comments. I'm extremely affected for days before and days after, and so are my kids. Um, but I'm just curious to hear if you guys notice a difference. So I picked up one of those. There was a different pattern, um, but I didn't really like it, so I only picked up the one that I did like. And then the last two things that I picked up from Dollar Tree and in this haul are these little double pumpkin tabletop decor. There was one other pattern. Again, I didn't like it. If you guys have been around, then you know I'm trying to be a good girl. I have tons of stuff as it is. So I'm doing my best to like keep my stash at a minimum and only grab the things that I believe I'll use or like, if you will. Um, it's really hard if you have the Dollar Tree ick, but I'm doing the best I can over here, okay? <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, fall vibes. I thought that pattern was pretty cute. It's not my favorite, but I do want to redo this. Um, I have an idea. So, picked up one of this pattern. And then they also have the Hello Fall. I really like this one. I don't think I will change that up, but we'll see. So, there they are. So I have been looking for something to go above my kid's kitchen playset since we moved into this home a year ago. And I just couldn't find anything because I didn't want anything too farmhousey that like didn't go along with the kids, quote unquote, but I also didn't want anything too kid-like. So when I saw this at Hobby Lobby, I could not get enough of it. The lanterns were originally 50. I paid 25 for one and about 15 for the other because it was broken and I fixed it and the big sign was 20 as well on sale. Now, I don't know about you, but I feel like tiered trays are super hard to decorate. There's just so many different tiers and just the way that you have to do it, you definitely need to have some time and patience. Do trial and error, put things in a place if you don't like it, switch it up. But this is what I came up with. And again, I will leave the link to this particular tiered tray down below in the description box, as well as the pinned comment for you guys. I got it on Amazon on like a super sale. And when I looked, it had dropped down to a really decent price. So I will link that for you guys. Like I said, I absolutely love this tear tray. It is worth every single penny. It is real wood and it is ginormous. So I'm so excited to share this with you guys. Also, y'all, I am going to be doing a YouTube course for you guys. A lot of people have asked me to teach y'all how to do YouTube plus all of the other money-making ways online. So check the pin comment as well as description for that as well to be put on the wait list. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to share this out. Subscribe if you haven't already to see what I DIY. And I just appreciate you guys so, so much. If nobody has told you today, you are stunning. You are worthy. You are so gorgeous. You can do anything you set your mind to. Coming from an addict who is nine years sober. Y'all, if I can do it, if I can have this life, so can you. I just recently joined an affiliate program that's going to teach you how to grow and monetize on your social media. It's also going to teach you how to affiliate yourself with different services and products and get paid to do that. I personally really enjoy the course and believe in it. So that's why I talk about it. 
Um, and I am literally earning between $1,000 and $5,000 per commission. Yes, I've been paid out. Yes, it has hit my bank account. Yes, it's a very real thing. So if you guys want any information, just text my number, the word affiliate. I would love to teach you. And if you don't know anything about affiliate marketing, I actually have a fact sheet 25 facts about affiliate marketing that I created. It's only 10 bucks and it will help you to make a decision if affiliate marketing is right for you. I will leave all of the information down in the description box as well as the pinned comment for you guys, or you can text my number on the screen and I will get you all that information. Text me the word affiliate. Or if you want the 25 facts, just text me the word 25 facts. I love y'all with my whole heart and soul. That is why I do all that I do because my life completely changed with no fancy degree and I love to share that wealth of knowledge with other people. With that being said, I love y'all so much. Stay tuned for a really big thing coming. I can't talk about it just yet, but it's coming soon. And it's for my crafty friends who only want to craft, maybe build a YouTube channel. That's all I can give you right now. So with that being said, I love y'all so much and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.